Hey guys, this is Teresa from Mimi's Bank of Life. I am donating some things to a church that is working together with Samaritan's Purse to take a big truck to people that have no water, no electricity, not much of anything right now to even eat and that were affected by the flooding from the hurricane. And I am just wanting to show some ideas. I'm taking this tomorrow. But, you know, it motivated me when I heard someone talking about it. And sometimes, you know, if you set a good example for someone else, it kind of snowballs and then other people get on board. So I just had this from my grocery shopping this week. Uh, I can't go shopping for this. So I'm just like taking things out of my house and putting it together. These are the large boxes. Oh, wow. We can get this out of here. Oh, of the blueberry Cheerios. So they're the large size. I, the, the date for the expiration date is good. I bought these at the Dollar Tree for $1.25 each a while back. I always kind of try to stock up when I see cereal on sale that I can eat or I can donate. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, there's eight. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight. Okay, and then, and this is my little, I have to toilet tissue, but I'm just going to send one uh, of mine from my house. And then I had hit that really super awesome deal from Dollar General when these were ringing up like 35, 36 cents a piece. So I bought 30 of them. I gave some away. I donated some and I'm donating the rest. I have some mints from the Dollar Tree. I have Mrs. Myers when these are normally five dollars at the Dollar Tree but they were ringing of a dollar twenty-five so I bought a bunch of them there's like oh, I think there's four of that my favorite glass cleaner is scrub free it's a new bottle of that and that's the twenty percent bonus I don't even know where I bought that but I had some ponds face cream and my in my cabinet I had a big bottle of shampoo I just bought of white rain I had new of the garlic from Kingsford I guess and I have some nuts in here and I have some soap I broke up a thing of soap but I wrote soap on it so they would know it was soap so, yeah, so uh, I guess what they're, what I'm hearing is these folks don't really have, um, they don't have a road, they don't have a bridge, they don't have a way, they don't have any gasoline for their vehicles. Um, <laughs> they are in a pickle. So that is, uh, you know, be helpful and being kind to people that you know you don't ever always want to be on the other end of this where you're the one doing the giving and the donating so these are going to go tomorrow to the church and then they're going to get to taken personally in the kinds of trucks that can get to the people that need to give this to people um on the ground like you know on the scene so anyway I just wanted to encourage you, you know, try to donate. Everybody can probably donate something. Alrighty, I'll talk to you later, guys. Love you. Bye.